Welcome back to I Teach. For this video, I am looking at slide, flip, and turn. And listen, I wish that my students was here because normally when I teach this, we get up, we dance, we move. The most I can do right now is shake the phone, but um, you can feel free to get up and actually try practicing sliding your body to the right or the left, flipping to the right or left, or turning and noticing with your body the difference between the three. When a shape slides, it can either go up, down, left, right, or diagonal. And when a shape slides, it's very important for you to remember that it doesn't change. It doesn't change. When a shape flips, you can flip it up, you can flip it down, you can flip it left, you can flip it right. But it's important to know that when a shape flips, it goes opposite, okay? It's like a reflection. When a shape turns, I have some arrows here just to give you an idea of what a turn looks like. It's when you're going basically around in a circular motion. When a shape moves in a circular motion, it changes direction. So let's apply those, those steps and th that knowledge of slide, flip, and turn to these shapes. For number one, I have given you the letter L. What I teach my kids is to look at the direction of the first shape and then look at the direction of the second one. For the first shape, our L is facing up. You know, I try to give this red marker a, a try because I love green. It's facing up, so I'm gonna put U for up. The second one, is it still facing up? No, it's facing down. First it was facing up, now it's facing down. Is that considered it doesn't change? Did it was it opposite? What what happened here? First it was facing up and then it was facing down. The correct answer is it was opposite. The opposite of up is down. Which one means opposite? Flip. So the correct answer here is flip. Now I can see the red coming in much better. Let's look at number two. Our first B is facing up. You don't have to spell it, just put a U. And our second B, I mean, it's over a little bit, but it's still facing up. It was facing up here, and now it's facing up here. What happened to that particular shape? It didn't change. The shape did not change. So that means that it slid. So we're going to write the word slide on the line. Let's look at the third one. The first time the heart was facing up. This time it's still facing up. Nothing changed. So which means nothing changed? Slide. So we're going to write the word slide. Let's look at the next shape. Now I drew a house. The house is standing and the roof is facing up. Now look at it. I think maybe wind blew it down because now it's facing this way. It's facing right. The roof is now facing right. So first it was facing up and now it's facing right. Is the opposite of up right? No, we learned in number one that the opposite of up is down. So that means it isn't flip. What about slide? Did it change? Remember, slide means that the shape doesn't change. First it was up and now it's right. Hmm, it changed, didn't it? It changed direction. So that means the answer is turn. I want to use one of my markers just to demonstrate turn. Sometimes turn is a little bit confusing. Let's just say my marker is the house. It was standing. And then the top of the house faced this way. Look at how my marker is turning. See, it turned. And that's exactly what happened to the house. It turned. Let's look at this shape. 
first the shape was facing this way, which is left. And now it's facing down. We know for a fact that the answer is not slide because slide means that it, did, it won't change. And first it was facing left and now it's facing down. What happened to this shape? Did it flip? Let's see, what is the opposite of left? The opposite of left is right, so it could not have flipped. The correct answer is turn. It changed direction. Wanna demonstrate one more time with my marker. First, we were facing left, and now we're facing down. Do you see my, my marker has turned and now it's facing down? So that's what the turn looks like. Let's look at C. C and C. First, the C was facing right. Now the C is facing left. Is it the same? It's the same shape, but are they still facing the same direction? No. So we know that for a fact, it's not slide. How about flip? Is it opposite? What is the opposite of right? Left. So first it was facing right, and now it's facing left. So the correct answer is flip. If you are a beginner with this skill, I recommend you use the letters for up, down, left, and right. It helps you to see exactly what is happening with the shape. For those of you who are skilled and you believe you got it, you can look and right away you will know exactly what happened to the shape. This shape flipped. This shape did a diagonal slide. This shape went up or it could have went down. Either way, it still slid. This one did a turn, so we would use an arrow like that. And we can use an arrow like this to signify this turn. And then flip, we could go down the middle and make it look like a mirror. Let's do the same thing for this. Sometimes you would see these lines and that kind of hints to you exactly what is happening with the shape. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that I helped you to understand slide, flip, and turn. And remember, get up. Shake your body and get your slide, flip, and turn on. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe for more upcoming videos.